ladies and gentlemen, the highest glory and honor goes to our almighty God for giving us this very beautiful day. It's a great honor for me to be standing here in front of all of you and to celebrate the 19th edition of the Zona Fest. I am really excited. Everybody is looking amazing with the different cultural attires which you have. Very blessed and honored to be here today. Your theme itself excites me as a person. Commemorate the past, unleash your imaginations. There's prism of possibilities which can happen in this team. The world is moving at a very fast rate. Modernization and urbanization are taking place at a very fast rate. But the one thing which should not be moved is our rich culture and our identity. People from around the globe, from all across the country, they come to Nagaland not to see the modernized buildings which we have, but to see our rich culture and our rich heritage. So it is very important for us to take care of what we have, our identity. We talk about tribes, different tribes here, but outside Nagaland, what are we known as? We are only known as one name, and that is the Nagas. So please know your own identity wherever you go. Promote the rich culture and identity which you have. For me, I love to collect shawls, okay? So I thank the Nagaland University for giving me this beautiful shawl again. I have a collection of 23 shawls. So this includes this is added to my new list, so now I have 24. I'm trying to collect as much shoulders as I can. People say that I'm a young man with an old man soul. Okay, so I really love culture. And today we have Dr. Tehsi Nyokititsu with us. She's popularly known as Mekala Alma. So because of her, many people have known about our culture because everywhere she goes, she wears our traditional attires. She promotes it in her own way. So we are very grateful to her. And I am very thankful to her as well because through her, I have learned many new traditional attires, even for the ladies. I have learned so many things. So everybody plays a different role to promote your own culture. It may be in the form of singing. It may be in the form, be in the form of arts, culture, music. So each and every one of us plays a very important role in promoting our own culture. I, along with some of my seniors, we wanted to promote culture, folk songs, folk stories. So we met the director of TAFMA two years back, and we came up with a concept to organize the biggest cultural festival folk competition here in Nagaland. So it is known as All Nagaland Folk Song Folk Fusion Competition organized by Kekre Koto in collaboration with Dafma. By the grace of God, that is the biggest cultural folk competition here in Nagaland. So the main motive of that event is to promote our rich culture and our rich heritage which we have. I have learned from the president that Nagaland University will be organizing and will be uh, inaugurating its first, first cultural club. So as the chief event manager of the biggest folk fusion competition here in Nagaland, today I give three direct state level entry slots to Nagaland University to come and participate in the third edition of the biggest cultural folk competition in Nagaland which will be held during the month of November. So practice well, all the best to Nagaland University, come and sing and let your talents be shown beyond the four walls of Nagaland. Now the second thing which I want to talk about as students and as aspirants is your goal, your vision. I have stated this before and I say this again. Your dream is like a tree. You have to water it. You have to nurture it. You have to take good care of it. It doesn't happen in an instant. It takes time. Rome was not built in a day. Your home was not built in a day. You have to weather the storm, be it good or bad. And eventually, slowly but eventually, if you take care of your tree, it will go into a big tree which will bear you fruits. So please understand that your dream is like a baby. You have to nurture it. You have to water it. You have to take good care of it. And eventually, it will give you shade from the sun, from the rain. In the process of pursuing your dreams, do not lose yourself on the way. Many people lose themselves on the way. Be who you are, it doesn't matter. Do not be afraid of failures. Failing is the stepping stone to success. The experience which you gain from failing is something which money can never buy. The experience which you gain from failing is something which success can never give you. I think I'm the best example of failure. I have failed in so many projects. I failed in so many business. I got scammed so many times, to be really honest. I don't think it's a scam, it will be a scam again. 
the experience which I gained from failing. I, this has built me to where I am today. I am just a small town boy. I say this everywhere I go. I'm just a small town boy trying to create a movement so that we can create a better environment, not only for ourselves, but for the future generations. So take good care of yourself wherever you go. And as students, education is very important. But on, in the process, try to have fun as well. Uh, the lecturers, please don't mind, but as students, sometimes it is okay to break the rules as well, right? You learn from it. You learn from it. The memories which you create from these moments, you will cherish for the rest of your lives. And if you want to collaborate together, work together, I'm always here to help each and every one of you. Let us create the best platform, not only for ourselves, but for the future generation. Let us start the movement from now. Let us create an era of change. This will only start when us youngsters come together, join together. Doesn't matter about diversity. Our local society is so di di uh, divided right now. But please know that with unity, uh, with diversity, there comes unity. Without diversity, there won't be any sense of unity. So today, the cultural songs, the cultural walks which you guys did, that was a very big performance. That was a very powerful performance. And I encourage that from each and every one of you. Let us bring an era of change so that people can talk about our good deeds even after we are long gone. Our legacy is very important. So be a pillar of change. With that, I would like to end my short speech and I officially inaugurate the 19th edition of the Zona Festival. Thank you so much, everyone.